Me and my ex, we fought all the time. We just bumped heads a lot about stupid stuff. Things that he'd say, things that I do, our different personalities and perspectives and communication styles. We just we just clashed a lot. Anyway, something I remember happening a lot is I went over it in my head and I realized I just got so frustrated when you said that to me because I can say that. You are totally misrepresented what I said and how I said it. No, I don't think I'm always right. I think I'm right right now. You never said that. Like, it got so bad, I had to start recording our conversations because I always felt like he was trying to make me feel like I'm crazy. And then one day I stumbled on this research that basically showed how men and women differ in the way their brains process, respond to, and remember stressful or emotionally charged experiences. During acute stress, the right side of a man's amygdala activates. The amygdala is like the major hub of emotional processing and, and threat perception. For women, the right stays relatively silent during a stressful experience. It's the left that's highly active. This is an important difference because the left side of everyone's brain tends to be more active when we process the details of an experience any experience emotional or not our right brains tend to focus more on the gist the big picture or the the meaning of things so this likely explains why scientists all across the world have found that women remember emotional events like arguments vacations birthdays first dates more quickly more accurately and more vividly than men do by the way i showed my ex these studies and he 100 percent brushed them off as just that science stuff. See why we never got along? Follow me for more on the very subtle but fascinating differences between male and female brains. <laughs>